it's Mari Buchanan and Michael Neff and we're here talking about Guatemala today and some pictures are sliding behind our voice here so you're actually seeing some shots from our mission discovery trip in Guatemala and uh, there's Michael Neff driving the, uh, the camp van. Uh, Michael, it seems like Guatemala has become this popular place for mission discovery uh, participants to sign up for. What's going on down there? Yeah, well, um, we are right now. We're partnering with uh, two different organizations: the Cairo School and the Jeremiah Project. And through them, we're reaching out to local families um, that uh, couldn't normally send uh, their kids to school. And so, um, through these local partnerships and other things that we have going on down there, it's just an exciting time and a, and a great ministry to be a part of. And plus, you couldn't pick a better place. It's one of the most beautiful places I've ever been. When you talk about place, you actually go to a town where you work. What's what's the town, and and uh, and where is that located in Guatemala? Yeah, well, um, about an hour um, south of Guatemala City is the the town of Antigua, Guatemala. And Antigua is just a real beautiful um, town. It's it's a main tourist attraction of Guatemala. And uh, and it's actually, you know, a colonial streets and there's a, a, a volcano that's right by it. Um, and, and it's a pretty wealthy area, but right on the outskirts um, is abject poverty. And so these are the people that we're targeting, is the people who live on the outskirts of Antigua and who either come into Antigua to work or um, are just trying to survive on whatever they have in the area. So I'm seeing in the, in the pictures we're looking at right now just a good mix of what looks like activities with, uh, with children as well as maybe some construction kinds of things. What happens in a typical day? Yeah, well, what we do is, um, as we're partnering with these other organizations, they find us families, and these families have, have real basic needs. Their roofs leak. They, uh, they need a new floor that, that isn't made of dirt, or um, they need a stove. And so what we do is, is basic uh, home repair projects, uh, fixing roofs, building a stove, um, and then alongside of that, um, we actually try to pull off a vacation Bible school, and we do home visits, and um, so it's it's a really good mix of physical construction as well as community outreach. It looks like there's some you, you go really uh, uh, it looks like a mix as well of going off the beaten path as well as going to some communities that uh, have some paved roads to. You know, we're looking right now at some pictures of uh, it looks like a vacation Bible school and a group that was prepared to do drama. So. How many kids would come to one of these typical outreaches like this, Michael? Yeah, well, I mean, it just really depends. Sometimes we're in a school, and so the number is it's kind of constrained to what the school has. So that's between 20 and 40. And in these particular, particular pictures, we actually were in this really small community called El Hato, which is you know, up in, in the mountains. And we had just done some basic promotion throughout uh, the village. And we actually saw 160 kids show up for VBS. So it was, it was really remarkable how many people were just excited about um, a team being there and, and, and just wanted to uh, take part in what we had for them. Well, we've got about a minute left, but if you were a youth leader or an adult group leader considering taking your group to Guatemala, what are the pluses of, say, going with uh, Mission Discovery down to Antigua, Guatemala, Michael? Well, uh, I would say that that really the plus is you're you're getting into a you're getting into a place that's outside of of a normal comfort zone it's you're taking your your group on really an an adventure and um you're seeing um how the rest of the world lives uh, you know in an area where it's just um com completely new and and uh you, you really kind of get your your kids involved in something amazing. Well, it looks like a great trip and it looks like people connect. That's Mission Discovery, Antigua, Guatemala with Mission Discovery. For more information, it's missiondiscovery.org.